welcome you to our Thursday jam. This is an Tonight, let's welcome God's presence by saying you are the greatest. For we want to give God the greatest and for what He deserves. Amen. Yes. I'm gonna give you what you deserve And all the things in reserve No matter how I'm feeling I still believe it's what you deserve All my praise belongs to you All my praise belongs to you Give you what you deserve and hold nothing in reserve. No matter how I'm feeling, no matter how I'm feeling, I still believe it's what you deserve. All my praise belongs to you. All my praise belongs to you. When I give you what you deserve And hold nothing in reserve No matter how I'm feeling No matter how I'm feeling I still believe it's what you deserve All my praise belongs to you All my praise belongs to you You're the greatest, I will sing it till it's heard. You're the greatest, it's what you deserve. You're the greatest, Jesus, I will lift your name up. Shout it to the world. You're the greatest, I will sing it till it's heard. You're the greatest, it's what you deserve. You're the greatest, Jesus, I will lift your name up. You're the greatest. You're the greatest. What you deserve. You're the greatest. Jesus, I will lift your name up high. Jesus, I will lift your name. Lord, 
Every night 
go on beside you, oh God. Father, we thank you and we will keep on singing, we will keep on praising you tonight, oh God. Because this is all that we got. This is all that we have, Father. So Father, we thank you, oh God, and we welcome you in this place. And to you, we bring back all the glory, honor, and praises. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Yes. Ayan, so isang um, napakagandang gabi na naman po muli sa ating uh, lahat. And maging sa ating mga nanonood po ngayong gabing ito. And to those who are joining us with this uh, Thursday, Jesus and Music. Ayan po. And so, of course, hindi po mawawala ang ating um, sharing for tonight, for, yun nga po, last Sunday, kung ano po yung um, napulot or nakuhang aral ng bawat isa po dito. And maging kayo po, pwede, pwede nyo rin pong i-share sa ating comment section. Pwede nyo pong i-share kung ano po yung naging, um, ano po yung um, reflection nyo nung Sunday po, last Sunday sa ating uh, preaching po. So, for tonight, so mag-umpisa tayo. Um, sige, Sister Maricel, ikaw. Wow, naka. <laughs> Ayan, salamat, uh, Joy. <laughs> Thank you. And last Sunday nga po ay, we are in the chapter 4 of the book of Joshua. And we have been uh, reminded itong word ng Panginoon na I believe is napaka-importante po sa buhay natin. For me, uh, ang reflection ko po nung last Sunday is, I have been reminded na uh, kailangan kong maging living testimony ng kabutihan ng Panginoon. Uh, tulad po nung uh, ni-remind ng Panginoon yung mga Israelites how they, how they have crossed over the Jordan River and pinag, pinapulot po sila ng stones para maging memorial ng miracle na ginawa ng Panginoon sa kanilang mga buhay. And in, in my life today, sabi nga doon sa preaching natin na Jesus in our generation is this rock, is this stone that signifies the goodness, the greatness of our God. And with Jesus in our hearts, we should also be uh, like this stone or like this rock na maging memorial po ng kabutihan ng Panginoon. In my life, I was reminded po that Sunday na uh, because I have this life na galing sa Panginoon that I should live it as a living testimony ng kabutihan ng Panginoon. I should always be thankful na minsan kasi parang baliwala lang yung mga yung mga maliit na bagay or mga blessings na parang kasi araw-araw na siyang nandyan but I was reminded na I still need always to give thanks and to testify yung goodness ng Panginoon because it is the memorial. It is yung makita yung greatness ng Panginoon sa buhay ko and in everything to, to give glory sa Panginoon at yung makita ba yung work niya sa buhay ko. So ayun, because uh, I, I sometimes I forgot na may mga ganitong ginawa yung Panginoon sa buhay ko. So last Sunday, I was reminded na I really need to show God and to present God to let uh, people ga see God na nag-work siya sa buhay ko bilang isang Kristiyano. So ayun po. <laughs> Yeah, isa na pagandang sharing mula po yun kay Sister Maricel. And then, of course, ating si Brother Joel naman po. Ayan, so for me naman, uh, yung memorial naman ng uh, miracle ng Panginoon sa akin is, nais ko lang i-share, uh, yung ang aking back. So ito po yung kumbaga parang memorial ng miracle ng Panginoon sa akin, yung aking likod, ayan, yung aking backbone. So, po, sa hindi po nakakalam, uh, almost one year. Uh, one year din po ata kung nalumpo, uh, hindi talaga ako makalakad and sobrang sakit and all I have to do is to uh, lie down and I thank God for His healing miracle na um, hinil niya ako dito sa karamdaman kong yun and ito talaga yung hindi ko makakalimutan it, it will really always uh, a symbol of God's miracle sa buhay ko and I will always remember it and every time na 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 um, nire-rebuke ako ng Panginoon I believe uh, God is talking to me sometimes kasi uh, pag medyo nakakalimutan ko na rin yung yung miracle na nagawa ng, ng Panginoon dahil sa mga struggles ko sa buhay dun sa mga um, nararanasan ko sometimes na I forgot na ang Panginoon ay gumagawa ng miracle and sometimes, ang Panginoon na hinihipo niya ang aking likuran, uh, just to remind me that I already healed you and I can do uh, many miracles pa sa buhay mo. So, yun lamang po. So, thank you rin, um, Brother Joel, for that 
uh, sharing. So, Mar Mika? <laughs> Ako, uh, same thought with Mase. And uh, sa, sa akin naman is, I really want to become, yun nga sabi ko last week, yun sa sharing ko, it's a do part na parang nandun na ako sa do, doing part. So, for me, it's really an inspiration to become a, a someone's memorial. Parang ganun. So, parang na, na uh, I really, it really encouraged me to become someone's memorial. Ganun. Parang, uh, when they see me, parang ganun nga, when they see me, makikita nila yung glory ng Panginoon sa akin. Parang ganun. Yung, yung, yun yung someone, ay something na nag-inspire sa akin na okay, something na pwede kong alalahanin, something na pwede kong uh, gawin for myself then And uh, one thing pa na nag-strike sa akin talaga is uh, nakakatuwa si Lord kasi sabi niya, uh, parang uh, tawag doon, mm, huwag kayong matakot, parang yun nga yung wa wala dapat tayong katakutan. Pero sabi ng Panginoon, uh, magkaroon tayo ng takot pero sa kanya lang. It, the, it is the only fear na allowed. Yun yung fear of God, fear of the Lord. So, yun nga, sabi nga sa Bible, the fear of God is the beginning of wisdom. So, so in every decision, doon din, na, parang na-realize ko din, every decision making na gagawin ko, I always to see, or always to consider na paano kapag uh, ginawa ko to, will it please as God? So, parang na ano ko din na, uh, siguro doon ka magiging wise in decision making mo na, na kailangan ayon or na ayon sa kagustuhan lagi ng ating Panginoon. Ayun. Ayun na. Ayan. Thank you, Sister uh, Mika. And of course, Brother Sai, how about you? Ayan. So, my reflection naman on the uh, Sunday service word naman is that um, the things that we do, uh, hindi naman talaga na, uh, na sa atin yon kundi uh, not, hindi sa ating kalakasan o kakayanan, kundi uh, ang ating Panginoon ang gumagawa nun para sa atin. So, it, He reminded me na, na I can't do things on my own. Sometimes kasi na iniisip ko na kaya ko to ng ako lang. Ganun, parang ganun. And I fail. So, yun. So, madalas ganun kasi yung nararanasan ko. I fail. So, hindi ko man lang kinoconsider si Lord na yung mga bagay na dapat kong gawin muna para sa Kanya. Uh, yun nga, yung uh, For example, yung magbasa na lang or makinig ng morning devotion, uh, yun. So, mga, mga bagay na mga ganun, mga simpleng bagay na ganun, na dapat ginagawa natin, na dapat inuuna natin uh, for uh, God, for uh, uh, para ang ating Panginoon ibigay niya sa atin yung uh, promise niya, di ba? And um, what I learned as well nung Sunday is that if, if we... Uh, uh, kung mapagtagumpayan natin ng isang bagay para sa kanya, uh, wag tayong uh, magbaba ng guard natin. Dapat on guard pa rin tayo kasi hindi pa naman yun yung uh, the best. Kasi uh, our Lord is uh, giving, uh, para bang hihigitan pa niya kung ano man yung naibigay pa niya ngayon sa'yo. So dapat uh, we uh, be on guard tayo palagi. Dahil yung kaaway, eh, laging umaatake sa atin, laging nagtatrabaho din yan, hindi tumitigil. So dapat be on guard and uh, isik natin lagi yung guidance ni Lord. Kaya nga yung uh, sinasabi nila na yung memorial. So, we always uh, think of uh, yung ginawa ni Lord para sa atin, para sa buhay natin. So, yun lang. Ayan. So, thank you, Brother Sai. And din nga po, um, uh, all of us have different uh, parang sharing for kasi yun, yun, yun nga po, uh, like Joel, uh, memor uh, Joel and Maricel, I should say so both memorial and Mika all about uh, fearing God and say nga na he can't do anything or he can't do a thing ng hindi si Lord yung um, kasama niya parang ganun so for me naman like Maricel and Joel and of course yung naalala ko lang yung sinabi rin ni Ate Karna last Sunday na kung sa kanya yung memorial niya is um, sa 7-11 pag nakit niya yung 7-11 is that nga parang bumabalik sa kanya lahat pero yung 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 part na yun is hindi para parang mag siya doon sa nangyari noon but of course parang doon lang yan ay doon yan maiisip na ala sobrang galing talaga ng uh, sobrang galing talaga ni Lord kasi look at me now parang ganun ba so yun kasi yun din yung yung um, sharing ko or yun yung yun yung last Sunday na um, parang napulot ko. Like, for example, sa family ko, 
Ganon. So, parang sila rin yung memorial. Pag nakikita ko si mama lagi na tumatawag sa akin, yung mga kapatid ko na uh, tumatawag sa akin, ganun. Parang sila, yun yung naging memorial ko kay Lord. Kasi yun nga po, um, sa family ko, I, I always, or I, parang ako yung priest ng family namin. Kasi yun nga, para ako, ako pala yung nakakakilala talaga kay Lord. So, I'm still trying to win them over. And then, yun nga po, yun yun, sila yung memorial ko. So, kapag na pag tumatawag si mama, andiyan na naalala ko ko yung mga, yung noon, yung ako noon na sobrang pag tumawag siya, kailangan niya ng pera. Instead na um, kay Lord ako tumawag, parang mag-iisip ako, ano, ano kayong gagawin ko para mabigay ko yung kailangan nila mama or ng family ko. Ganon. So, yun yung part na um, this this time, which is I'm really, really thankful uh, na nakilala ko si Lord kasi siya talaga yung living rock or siya talaga yung uh, rock natin eh, di ba? na pag wala siya, hindi talaga natin kayang, um, hindi talaga mapapangyari yung mga gusto nating uh, mapangyari. And if ever man na mapangyari yung mga gusto nating nangya- mangyari, but then hindi natin kasama si Lord or hindi natin siya um, ginawang, parang hindi natin siya kasama dun sa mga ginawa natin. Parang andun na nangyari pero, or nakamit mo siya, pero parang parang may kulang. Parang ganun. So, um, yun yung naging, ano ko, yun yung naging Um, parang naiisip ko lagi or in pag may ginawa akong isang bagay dapat anyan lagi si Lord or dapat inaas ko lagi or sinisik ko lagi si Lord dun sa isang bagay or dun sa isang decision na kailang or yun nga kung may gagawin ako para sa family ko para sa ministry ko para sa office sa mga agent ko parang I al- I al- I'm always being reminded na kailangan kasali si Lord lagi dun sa gagawin ko dun sa decision ko kasi yun nga po mga kapatid um, the Lord is our rock He is Jesus is the living rock so He sacrificed everything para sa atin so why not um, sacrifice din natin everything for Him di po ba? so because we know na si Lord ay nga po katulad ng sinabi ni Imika kanina fear God fear Him in the sense na um Parang, ang tawag dito, fear Him in the sense na yun ba yung mga promises ba niya? Parang, dun yung iisipin natin yun. Pag hindi ginawa yung mga bagay na na ayon sa Kanya, parang, ala Lord, ba, hindi ko makukuha yung blessings. Parang ganun. But then, Lord, the Lord is a gracious God na what, what you need to do is to always ask for Him. Pag may ginawa kang kasalanan, you, you don't need to hide from Him but to always Uh, seek for Him, to always be desperate, to always be hungry, to always long sa Kanyang presence, to always long for the Holy Spirit to dwell upon you. And tonight, kung ano man po yung mga naging reflection natin for last Sunday's preaching, let us all be reminded or isa puso po natin ito. And let us always seek His presence. Let us always seek the Lord. Let us always long to know Him more. Let us always long to seek His presence. Because this is the right thing to do. It's Jesus. Like a fire, shut up in my bones. I want the world to know that you are God. With a passion burning deep within. Want the world to know that you live. Let your presence come and saturate every part of me. Make me new. Let your spirit come and move within. Fill me once again. Cause I 
We have doubted your power. We have doubted your spirit, Panginoon, that can move in our lives. We have full of unbelief, Panginoon, that you can work in us, that you can work in our lives. God, tonight, Lord, we repent and we ask for forgiveness, Panginoon. For we have failed to believe in your words. We have failed to believe in your works. We have failed to see you working in our life. We have failed to see every miracle, Panginoon, that you have been doing in our lives, O oh God. Lord, patawarin niyo kami. And God, tonight, we just want to commit again ourselves to you, O oh God. We are desperately longing for your presence, Panginoon. For your Spirit, O oh God, to come and fill us. And fill us, O oh God. For all we need in our life is you, for us to achieve all our dreams, for us to walk in the path of righteousness, Panginoon, it is only you, only you that we need, only you that we want, O oh God. Lord, we pray for our brothers and sisters. We pray for the church tonight, Panginoon. For we have forgotten, O oh God, all these miracles and good things that you have done in our lives. And God, tonight we want to remember. We want to remember and give thanks, Panginoon. Give glory sa you, Panginoon. For you have been so, so good sa aming mga buhay. Even in this church, O oh God, for how you have transformed and breakthroughs come upon breakthrough, Panginoon. In this church, God, we thank you and we give glory and honor to you, Panginoon. And we want to remember your goodness, O oh God, even in the lives of our brothers and sisters, of the members of this church, O oh God, and all the 611 family, Panginoon. God, we thank you. We glorify you. We lift your name up above all names, Panginoon. And we want to remember your goodness, Panginoon, sa mga buhay namin. God, we thank you. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, God, for your goodness. We thank you, Lord, for every miracle that you have given us. We thank you, God, for every breakthroughs. We thank you, Lord, for every promotion. We thank you, Lord, for all the struggles that we have overcame, Panginoon. At sa lahat pa, Lord, ng iyong mga pangako, Panginoon, na ibinigay mo sa amin for the promises, O oh God, that are in ahead of us, Lord. We thank you. We thank you, Lord. And we just want to honor you and give glory to you, Panginoon, sa gabi ito. We want to remember your goodness and acknowledge, Lord, your greatness in our lives. God, that we, you can do great things, more great things in our lives, Panginoon. Lord, we thank you. We thank you, God. Yes, Lord, we continue to pray, Father God, for all our brothers and sisters, Panginoon of 611 Manila, Lord God. Most especially, Lord, with our cell group, Father God. May you continue to unite us, Lord God. Unite us in one spirit, Father God. I ask, Panginoon, ng bawat isa, Lord God, I, their hearts and mind be open, Father, for the teachings of the church, Lord. And Lord, I ask her for all the cell uh, members, Lord God, for their hearts to be open, Panginoon, for their hearts to be open to submit, Panginoon, sa kanilang leaders, Father God, their cell leaders, Lord God. May you unite them, may you keep the bond between them, Panginoon. I also ask, Lord God, for your, um, for the wisdom, Panginoon, for the strength to be given to us as leaders, Lord God. For us to be more passionate, Panginoon. To, for us to be have more compassion sa aming mga anak, sa aming mga uh, cell members, Lord God. Give us this heart, Lord, that always cares for them, Father. For us to give the right instruction sa kanila, Panginoon. Because we believe, Lord, 
that you have you, you've given them, Panginoon, you've given us to them, Father God, as their spiritual mother and father, Lord. And so, Lord, give us the strength, Panginoon, give us the wisdom that we need, Lord, for them to follow us, Panginoon, as we, in one heart, Lord, follow you, Father God. May the unity, Panginoon, among us, May there be a love, care, Panginoon, compassion, Lord God, in between us, Father God. And Lord, I also I pray, Father, for all those leaders, may it be in the cell group, may it be in their company, Father God. I ask for your wisdom, Panginoon, for them to lead rightfully, Panginoon, for them to lead, Panginoon, according to your will, Lord God. Give them, Panginoon, the wisdom, the right wisdom, Lord God, na nagagaling lamang po sa iyo, Father. For them to lead the team, for them to lead their, their cell group, for them to lead the ministry, Panginoon. For them to lead it to you, Father God. And Lord, we always give us this heart that always longs for you. It's always desperate to know you, Lord God. Because we know, Lord, that nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible for you, Lord. Father, we continue, Lord, to raise Panginoon ng mga leaders namin sa aming simbahan, sa kahit na anumang simbahan, O God. Father, we pray, Lord, that may they always see their memorials, Panginoon, sa iyo. May they always see the stones, Panginoon, they build for you, for your altar, O God. And Father, we pray that may they always feel the joy, O God, in serving you, Lord. May they always feel your presence, Panginoon, even, Lord, sa mga pagkakataong na panghihinaan sila, O God. Panginoon, Ikaw, Panginoon, ang sumama sa kanila, O God. Ikaw, Panginoon, ang siyang gumabay sa kanila at magparamdam ng iyong pagmamahal, O God. And Father, we pray that may give them the strength always, O God, to lead this Joshua generation, O God. And as we come and cross every Jordans, O God, ay sila, Panginoon, ang mag-lead sa amin, O God. Sila, Panginoon, ang manguna. May you always use them, O God, for your glory and for your kingdom. Father, we are lifting their lives, Panginoon, sa iyo, O God. And may they set us an example, Panginoon, sa lahat ng taong sumusunod sa kanila, O God. Father, I pray that may these people, O God, may your light shines, O God, sa kanila. And may all the people, Panginoon, ay makita, Panginoon, ang iyong kabutihan sa kanilang mga buhay, O God. Father, we pray na Ikaw lamang, Panginoon, ang siyang maparangalan. Ikaw lamang, Panginoon, ang siyang maitaas sa bawat buhay, Panginoon, na meron kami. Okay. So, Father, we, we just wanna say thank you tonight, O God. I wanna say we love you, Lord, for truly you are great. And we love you, Father, for you are great. And your works are great, your works are always good. Yes, it is always good. Your name is like hand on my lips. Your spirit like water to my soul.
you, Lord. We love you, O God. We declare, Panginoon, that, Lord, tonight we just want to say we love you, O God. We thank you, Lord. And, God, we continue to pray, Panginoon, for all our brothers and sisters, especially, Lord, uh, sa mga kasama po namin tonight. Every family, so God, every heart, every life, so God, who are with us tonight, Lord, I pray that may you continue, O God, to dwell and to live, O God, in each heart, in each life, Panginoon, that every day, every hour of our lives, Father, we will continue, O God, to see you working in our life. We will continue, O God, to remember you, that you are in control. You are sovereign above all things. And God, we just want to lay down our lives unto you. Everything that we have, all our dreams, all our... Uh, meron, na meron kami, Panginoon, even our families, our careers, our gifts, oh God. Because we know, Lord, that all these things come from you. Father, we thank you, we thank you, and we want to bring back all the glory and praises and glory unto your name alone. This we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Yeah, we can have one at the end of the day. Praise the Lord. Yes, we thank you, everyone, for joining us tonight. And we want to see you. Yes, surely we want to see you next week again on our Thursday jam. This is Jesus and Music.